people often ask about when you're driving your Tesla, where are the superchargers? How do you know where the superchargers are? So I'm gonna show you like what that's all about right here. So let's get to it. So if you notice on our big map here, which is 17 inches long, which is humongous, we can actually click on this little guy right here. And actually it displays superchargers that are around your area. It also will show you um, destination chargers too. So if you stick your finger and just kind of pinch out, all your chargers will start populating. So if you notice the ones in red are the ones that are going to be your superchargers and then the gray ones are going to be your destination chargers. If you notice where I'm at, I'm at a field hockey tournament in the middle of nowhere, Pioneer, Holland, New York. We have one supercharger right here that um, we do go to every once in a while. but. Uh, other than that, we don't have many in our area. We mainly charge at home, which is what you're supposed to do in the first place. So as I pinch out, you'll see how many superchargers are in the US. It's pretty crazy. You can understand how you can travel from one side of the US to the other. Isn't that insane? Tons of superchargers. Tons of California, obviously. But there's actually a lot everywhere. All the main routes. We've actually traveled from New York all the way over to Arizona, Sedona area, which is an awesome trip. And we've also done a trip from New York down to Florida and New York to Virginia Beach and all that good stuff. So it's definitely doable. And with the free supercharging, it's awesome. You just gotta make sure you plan ahead. Make sure you don't try to you know push yourself. And we've done times where we've driven till two or three o'clock in the morning because I under or overestimated or whatever like the amount of time it took to get from one place to the other. And obviously the charging takes a little longer sometimes depending on how fast you're driving. But there you have it. There's all the superchargers. It's really really simple to look to view them. Um, if you wanted to drive to one particular, you can just click on hit and navigate. But that's not. This is not how you would actually do your mapping. You would actually, um, you know, obviously go into your navigate section right here, and then you might select somewhere you're going to go. Let's say you're going to Starbucks Coffee here, and if if there's a supercharger from there to there, it's going to show you to go to the supercharger. In this situation, it doesn't. It just says here you, you got a battery to go there to there. Let's do like a bigger trip. Let's say we're going to go to like the Virginia Beach or something like that. It'll actually let us know where we got to go to charge, which is really neat. So let's hit navigate. Let's see if we can find some place that's... Where are we going? Fort Lauderdale, Florida. There you go. So it actually calculates... There it goes. So it tells you where you gotta go. So you're going from here to Erie, PA, and then through to Pittsburgh, and then West Virginia, and then it's kinda going through each charger all the way down to Fort Lauderdale. Pretty pretty freaking awesome. And also here you can kinda see like how, like this here is always saying 40 minutes of charging here, and then 50 minutes and 40 minutes. So you can see like obviously they say, oh 15 minutes of charging to get to 80%, but Realistically, I mean, you're looking at, you know, you're getting there at 33% battery and now you got to charge it about 40 minutes. We generally charge a little bit more because not everybody likes to drive at 60, you know, when you're driving at 60 or 55 miles an hour, you're saving battery. But, uh, you know, I like to drive 70, you know, if it's 65, I'm going 70, 75. So but you can see here, like, uh, each one of the charging areas, 
and then down below here you see how long you know how many miles it is and how many hours you're looking at like you know 29 hours and seven minutes that's if you didn't make any bathroom stops or nothing like that like hopefully you're going to the bathroom during these charging times but that doesn't include for obviously you might get a hotel somewhere stay overnight which you're going to do um, generally what we do when we're planning is we actually you know look at our destinations see how long it gets to each area and like, okay we're gonna get a hotel here and then we'll, you know, we'll, we'll redo it again and say, okay, we're gonna get a hotel here, you know, and, and obviously once once you get there, you're there. So there you go. So I kind of showed you all the superchargers, and then like how how the maps work, routing from A to B. Until next time, we'll see. Oh, if you like Tesla Tim, subscribe to our channel.